Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here, and in this video, we'll be doing the performance testing of the Poco F5. So, Poco F5 is the latest device, and let's go to the about phone. And this device comes with Android 13 out of the box, MIUI 14. And if you look at the detailed specs, it has Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 2 chip. It's very powerful, 2.91 gigahertz octa-core processor, 12 gigabyte RAM, and you also get an 8 gigabyte RAM. It can be expanded as well. So, Android 13 and MIUI 14 is the version so poco f5 so that's the version so we are going to do the performance testing of this device we will be doing the cpu throttling test and to benchmark geekbench and see how good are the experience is on this device uh, what all performance values it comes up with so let's begin so before getting started if this is your first time on this channel do hit that red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin so the first test would be the cpu throttling test so let's just open the cpu throttling app so there you go we'll just start the test and uh, we'll uh, see uh, the result so this is the cpu throttling test it's a 20 minutes or rather 15 minutes test and let's see how much uh, the value uh, the device gets in uh, with uh, the throttling uh, of the cpu So now we completed uh, the CPU throttling test and you can see here the max value is 235, average value is 220 and the minimum value is 197 gips. Now you can see here CPU throttle to 87% of its max performance which is quite good I would say. Uh, no major throttling issues as such and uh, uh, you can see that uh, the overall values looks quite good uh, for this device. So the Snapdragon uh, uh, 7 Plus Gen uh, 2 is quite good uh, cheap in terms of overall CPU performance as well. So next let's go to the Antitude test. So next uh, let's see the Antitude benchmark score for this device. So we have uh, run the benchmark score. So you can see here uh, 9 lakh uh, uh, or I, rather 9 lakh 49,032 is the score we have got uh, with uh, the Poco F5. So it's a very good score and in fact it is close to a million value. Now you can see here CPU score, uh, the GPU score, uh, the memory score and the UX score. It's a very powerful chip. The Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 2 chip is really powerful and it actually shows up uh, in the benchmark results and you can see here in terms of uh, the battery or rather the temperature rise it went up to 41 percent 41 degrees while testing and uh, let's also uh, see uh, the storage test of this device so let's just this is ufs 3.1 storage so let's see uh, the values so let's do the uh, sequencing uh, read and write uh, speeds of uh, this device so you can see here uh, 76,691. That's quite a good score for a UFS 3.1 storage uh, device. So that's the Antutu benchmark score for the Poco F5. So next, uh, let's uh, run the uh, the uh, Geekbench 6 uh, test, and uh, we'll uh, show you here. So this is the Geekbench test. Uh, so let's run the uh, Geekbench 6, and let's see how much value it comes up with. So now we can see the benchmark result uh, single core score is 1645 and a multi core score is uh, 4316 so that's the uh, Geekbench 6 and uh, you can see here all the details here the single core score and uh, uh, all the details are available here uh, for the Geekbench 6. So that was the Geekbench uh, 6 uh, results for this device. So that is the performance testing of the Poco F5. So all in all, it's a pretty good device, uh, especially with the Snapdragon 7 Plus uh, uh, Gen 2 chip. It's a very powerful chip. In fact, uh, very close to the flagship 8 series. Uh, in fact, last year's flagship uh, series was quite similar to 1 million. And here also you get the Antitude benchmark score of almost a million. So it's a really powerful device and you get uh, 8 gigabyte RAM as well as 12 gigabyte RAM. And the default storage is 256 gigabyte storage, LPDDR5 RAM and uh, UFS 3.1 storage. So it's a really good performing device in this price segment. So that is the performance testing of the Poco F. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit that subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.